Ken is a leader of a gang, an Asian gang, a Tong, and uh, he also has like a low-key operation where he kind of takes care of rescue dogs and um, I guess his way of redeeming or getting the money back from people uh, as a loan shark is kidnapping other dogs and waiting for their owners to come and rescue them. And the messed up part is, as he states, a lot of them don't come back for their dogs. Oh, the chemistry is great. Um, I actually know Sandra and Nora for many years. Um, so Nora's like my little sister and Sandra's like my older sister, you know, in like real life. And uh, just seeing them on screen together is just great. They're both hilarious in their own ways. And I think the script is written so well for them to kind of show the comedic sides of both of them and what they do. And it's kind of cool to see Nora, who is more of a comedic actress, take kind of a backseat to Sandra's uh, comedy in this film, um, which I think people are gonna be really stoked for. In this film, Nora and Sandra are Korean and half Korean and half Chinese, um, and which Nora is and Sandra's Korean. And you know, I obviously grew up watching Sandra, and Nora is somebody I came up with. So, seeing them as sisters and and seeing the childhood to them now, I think in the film really speaks to me a lot. And there's just little subtle things that I think uh, a lot of Asian Americans will pick up, and and it'll mean a lot to them. I think they'll love the comedy of it all um, between Sandra and uh, Aquafina, who's just, they're like icons in what they've accomplished so far, you know what I mean? And the fact that they're joining forces for a film like this is going to be amazing. It's, it's like another one to add to the history of like Asian American films.